Hi guys, Neil Waterhouse. I'm doing a series of quick videos about how to get more views on eBay. If anybody new to this channel, my name is Neil Waterhouse and I've been selling online full time for over 25 years. I'm the author of a million dollar eBay business from home and creator of Dropship Formula. So when somebody searches eBay for anything, one of the four core values that eBay search engine takes into account is what eBay calls convenience. In short, convenience is how fast a buyer will receive their item after they order it. And there's several things we as eBay sellers can do to optimize any eBay listing to make the listing appear higher in the search results, as I'll show you in this video. The higher a listing appears in the eBay search results, the more views it will get. And the more views, the more sales for a proven product. Let me show you. If I do a search for say, trailer cover, eBay will show me a whole load of listings for trailer cover in the search results. If I click on, say, the top one, as you can see, if I order this item, eBay tells me it has an estimated arrival date of between August 25 and August 30. If I scroll down in the search results and click on another listing from another seller, eBay gives me an estimated delivery time three days later, between August 28 and September 1. The way that the eBay best match search results works is, for the convenience aspect, if everything else is equal, is eBay gives more weight to any eBay listing that can be delivered to a buyer the fastest. And the good news is, there's several things a seller like you and me can do, or can easily do, that changes the date that buyers will see, and therefore how high up your listing appears in the search results. First of all, what is your shipping location or your postcode that you're using in your eBay listings? If you don't set the postcode or the zip code when you list an item, eBay will use your default postcode that you set up in your eBay account instead of the correct postcode of where the item is being shipped from. If you ship from a different postcode to what you're showing in your listing, you can get into trouble from eBay as eBay calls this zip code mismatch. The reason for this is your home default postcode could be literally a thousand kilometers from where your supplier actually ships the item from. A buyer may live near you and consequently eBay will show a delivery date or delivery time based on your postcode and the buyer's postcode. But the good news is you can revise or edit any eBay listing and change the shipping postcode at any time for each individual listing. The postcode or zip code is located below shipping when you create or revise any eBay listing. I've seen many eBay sellers over the years make the big mistake of not changing the shipping postcode and they've, they've not realized that eBay is penalizing them because eBay thinks the item is located in the middle of nowhere. As an example, one of my students lives an hour west of Cairns, Australia, which is located near the very top of Eastern Australia. This lady is drop shipping with the majority of her products being drop shipped from Melbourne, which is near the bottom of Eastern Australia. So what was happening was if a buyer located in say Melbourne searched eBay and found one of her listings, eBay was adding an extra five days onto the shipping time because eBay thought she was shipping from Cairns. This one simple change over 10x her business. The next way we can bring forward the delivery date that eBay shows buyers is setting the correct handling time for each individual listing. For example, this listing is set to a three day handling time, but if this was changed to one business day handling time, it would reduce the estimated delivery time by two days, which would bump the listing higher up the search results and hence get more views. More views for a proven product equals more sales. Of course though, only put in a handling time that you or your supplier can achieve. To change your handling time, you can do that any time when listing or revising any eBay listing by simply changing the field in the listing that says handling time. The next thing we can do to optimize this convenience aspect is, what shipping provider are you selecting when you list your items? This seller has selected Australia Post Standard Parcel. Now, depending on your postcode, if you choose a courier instead of Australia Post, eBay will often reduce the delivery times to be the same as Express. Again, this can shave days of the delivery times and again, bumps your listing higher up the search results. Of course, only select the transportation company that you or your suppliers are using. If you want to see what delivery date your customers will see, just go to one of your eBay listings, click on the See Details hyperlink, and then enter any postcode, and then click Get Rates. Now you'll be able to see the delivery date that your buyers will see, and you can experiment with making these changes I've said in this video to see how your delivery dates change. 
The fourth thing that we can do to get more views on eBay by optimizing for convenience is to make sure you've added an express option. Here you can see that this seller has added an express option. The next thing we can do is to check the eBay account that you're using to see if eBay has added a shipping penalty to it. This is also known in the industry as a shipping buffer. To find out if you have a shipping buffer applied to your eBay account, look at the delivery time for one of your listings and then list another similar item, but not the same item, not a duplicate item, on your spare eBay account and check the delivery time there. If your main account is showing a longer delivery time than your spare eBay account, contact eBay and ask them what you need to do to remove the buffer they've applied to your eBay account. To stop yourself getting buffers added to your account, it is important to make sure items are delivered to your buyers in a specified time frame that eBay shows to your buyers. If you select a high speed shipping service like Express, but your supplier only uses standard shipping, eBay will show a delivery time or delivery date earlier than will be achieved, which means the items will continually arrive late. The same with handling time. If a supplier takes say three days to dispatch an item, but you've got a one day handling time, Again, eBay will show a delivery time that won't be achieved, thus the item will arrive late. If any eBay seller's deliveries are repeatedly late, eBay will automatically add a buffer to all of a seller's delivery times. So that items are then delivered in the time frame that eBay shows to buyers. For this reason, it's important to make sure handling times are correct and the postcodes within each listing are correct and the correct shipping service is selected within each individual listing. eBay automatically reviews the delivery times or buffer every month on the 20th for all eBay accounts worldwide. If you also want to know how to find eBay best selling products, make sure you watch this video up here and I'll put a link on the screen and below. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comment section below. Until next week, stay safe, list more, sell more. This is Neil Waterhouse.